Welcome back to another Unturned video. Today we're going to return on the Arid Survival server and we have the final episode of the survival series. If you haven't watched the previous episodes, quick recap is we basically did some raiding, getting very geared in the process, a ton of PvP and, and last time we left off where we found a count raid and today we're going to continue with that and then we will also do a very good revenge base raid with a ton of action, a ton of loot and non-stop PvP. If you guys do want to watch that series, I will have the link in the description below to the full playlist. Also, if you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more in the future make sure to drop a like let's aim for 500 likes also subscribe if you haven't already each one helps the channel grow a ton last video i announced the mythical giveaway and this is the winner to claim your prize please join my discord at discord.gg slash ldg and contact me over there today we're going through another one which is a lucky coins isotope fussy lot if you guys want to win this make sure that you have liked subscribed and comment something below if you're a channel member you also have a higher chance of winning and if someone wishes to become a member make sure to click the join button below but before we head into the video i'd like to shout out today's sponsor are you guys looking to start your own answer network with survival roleplay or even just a private server to play with your friends then make sure to check out pine hosting with pine hosting you can set up your server in a very short amount of time the performance is very high quality and extremely easy to use and to learn when i started off with my own ldg network i literally had no idea how to do anything but with pine hosting's easy navigation it only took me a few seconds to just learn the basics they have locations all around the globe cheap and affordable pricing and have hostings not just for Unturned, but for many other games, including Rust, Ark, and Minecraft. My favorite feature from Pine Hosting is the fact that with just one click, you can install plugins and mods into your servers. Got a server with another provider? Don't worry, they will personally help you to move your servers as well. If you guys want to start your own Unturned servers, make sure to check out the link in the description below and use the code LDG for 30% off, and let's get straight into the video. So I assume I'm going to TPA back. I literally just died. I think my team are all there. They should be on the roof. They were taking the helicopter. Yeah, we're up here now. This base is live. There are people trying to counter raid. And we're going to do the same thing. Problem is I don't have anything. And we're just getting sniped at. Yeah, we could see from inside here. There's people right down here. I'm going to die. I have nothing, man. I got myself a gun. I killed one. Take the other gun. Dude, I'm getting chased. Yeah, I died. There are too many people over there, man. But we're not, I don't think we're gonna use raiding gear. I think we're just gonna try to kill as much people as possible. There's somebody getting very mad in the spawn. I've also quite profited from the PvP in here because I did vault a bunch of Sabot magazines. And we did depot. Then we went back with our heli. I need to take a gun. Let's take the TX. Let's take some mags as well. Let's TPA back. Hopefully we don't die. Oh yeah, we are back. I'm gonna drop down. I mean, they're trying to raid. Alright, there's a dude there. He should be so low. How is he not dead? Alright, there we go. He's dead. Let's check out what loot he had. Just open vaults instantly. Let's drop those. There's even... Oh my god. I wanted to depot the sabot as well. Yeah, and I just lost night vision. So when I was down there, my teammates actually went deep. They're gonna raid actually. Yeah, they are. Oh, HEMO belt. I don't even know what's going on to be honest. I should probably help them out to raid. Let's hope they actually have some good loot though. Alright, this one broke. Looks like a bunch of high tier loot. Yeah, a bunch of honeybee mags. Alright, let's take all the good important items. Right, so there's people above us. They're trying to raid to get to us. These guys are another counter raiding group. I don't know if we should actually let them try to kill us. Because if we kill them, we'll get their loot as well. There's a lot of chaos going on, man. Oh, they're putting C4 actually. Alright, let's go to the side. Yeah, they broke the hatch. They broke the ladder as well. Oh, he's coming down. There we go, he's dead. He has some loot. Oh, they're throwing grenades. They're just spamming grenades everywhere actually. Yeah, they took a heli. I don't think that was our heli, though. Pretty sure my teammate did take it back to where our base is. Oh, he pushed. Oh, I didn't even see him, man. Yeah, they're just spamming grenades again. I don't think they could reach us from where we are, to be honest. They killed another... Wait, they... I think they killed themselves. Yeah, that dude is just up there. You know, I'm pushing down now. If they push down and we kill them, they lose their loot. Right, let's refill our mags. Yeah, he's coming down. I think he came down with melee down again he's dead i think they're just jumping with melee i think they're trying to get easy kills or something i don't know what they're trying to do either that or they're just broke but i think they actually left there's nobody around i think they gave up trying to counter there's people up under us though i oh, should be solo i'm not gonna jump down though i don't think they have any good loot i should try to leave now now we are raiding a tower base and we did actually get a bunch of subot mags from this raid so we can go finish that raid next i think that would be a good idea here's guy there should be solo hit him three times all right so this is what we were raiding there's a bunch of adamantium lockers and we did raid the very bottom of it 
But we're gonna finish it now. We're gonna hopefully get some good loot from it. And this locker broke. Yeah, that previous locker was quite low already. These are gonna take a while to break them. Alright, broke and golden Zolash, a bunch of junk. Alright, let's reload. Let's hope we get something good from this. Alright, broke and... Okay, a bunch of blasting caps, some explosive compounds. That's not too bad. Let's take ourselves the next subbot. Let's blow up this one next. Yeah, I'm out of ammo. Alright, broke. Looks like there's a bunch of guns. Some of the random junk. There's some clothes. Ammo, circuit board. Alright, there's still a couple left. I don't know if we should actually try to go inside. In the bottom, there were a bunch of sentries still. So hopefully, there won't be any inside. Alright, broke and... Nothing that good, sadly. There are, there are some good loot, but... What we really need is raiding gear. We're just getting a bunch of PvP guns, which they will be useful later on. Oh yeah, let's reload. Let's help them out, raid this one. I broke and okay a bunch of casings. There's a bunch of ammo for AMR too. That's actually really good This one broke looks like a bunch of mag boxes. Nothing that crazy. I think this is the final locker as well I broke and some more explosive compounds a bunch of red circuit boards a bunch of blasting caps There's a detonator All right now. I think we should go inside All right, He's gonna use C4. Yeah, we're through finally. Yep. There's a bunch of more loot Bunch of PvP guns. Yeah, there's a bunch of lockers still. There's HMG, a uh, stack of copper. Oh yeah, now we gotta raid all of these. There's a claimed bed here. Well, let's start raiding these lockers next. Let's hope these ones have better loot than the ones outside. And it looks like a bunch of junk too now. And this one broke. And Nemesis, GPs, TXs. That, that's kind of basically it. I will right, switch this GP. This one has a drum. Let's take that stack of copper coil as well. That could be very important later on. And this one broke and looks like a bunch of junk. Nothing that insane. There's motor oil. Let's go. Yeah, there's nothing that good though. There's still these four lockers over here which we're gonna raid next. Alright, so we're done with the raid. We didn't really get anything that insane to be honest. We did get a bunch of PvP guns, a bunch of materials. But in terms of raiding gear, we just got a few explosive compounds in return. Some casings, a few gunpowder here and there. But yeah, we're done with this raid. It took us all day to finish this raid, but at least we're done. Okay, guys, so after that, I did leave the server, and I did join the next day. Now, as soon as I joined back, the base that we were living in got completely raided. It got offline raided by a group, and my teammates did manage to save a lot of gear, and they built above the base that we had. And in this part of the video, we are going to online raid the guys that offline raided us. I'm back on, and we got raided. Yeah, our base got completely annihilated, but my teammates did manage to save a lot of the loot on us. Oh my god, okay, yeah, they actually still have a lot of raiding gear. I didn't know they had that much, but I guess they grinded a lot. Let me just drop everything that I've logged off with, so that they can decide what they can take or what they can't take. Now, apparently we got offline raided by a group that kind of hates my team, but my team knows where they live. They live kind of close, so we're gonna hit them up, we're gonna try to online raid them. They have a pretty decent sized base as well it's not very small hopefully we managed to succeed and so i'm gonna place my bed right over here could drop the other one they built a pretty nice base though our base looks kind of better than the one that we had all right so there are people under us under our base it could be the guys that raided us yeah, he's dead yeah it is he's one of them they think they just blew up our car Oh, hell no. Yeah, one of my teammates is going crazy right now because they, they blew up our car. I really want to know where they are. They're going to be under us this whole time, probably. Yeah, he's right there. He's dead. Alright, let's reload. These hatches are OP, man. Yeah, he's literally right under me right now. Hit him. It's kind of hard to aim at them sometimes, though. Right, let's refill. Get ourselves a full drum. Let's go on the roof. Maybe we get ourselves a better angle. Yeah, they killed some of us. My teammate is at the very bottom. Yeah, they're all down there. Alright, two guys dead. Alright, I just killed all of them. Literally destroyed them, bro. And they have some loot. GPs, TXs. Yeah, they're gonna keep coming back. Which is probably a perfect time to try to go raid them right now, actually. And so apparently this is their base. My teammate's already going deep, man. Don't tell me that it's partially open already. Oh yeah, it is. Wait, we're already in. Dude, there's so much load. There's literally crates and wardrobes and 
stuff everywhere. How the hell do you navigate through this base? Bro, there's so much junk. How do they know where loot is? This is literally the most confusing base ever. Not in terms of design, in terms of world, <laughs> all this loot. Alright, yeah, my teammate's gonna raid. Dude, a few C4 and this base is literally destroyed. There's a bunch of loot over here. Oh my god, yeah, that did a lot of damage. Dude, there's so much loot. There's so much junk. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we didn't destroy the beds either. I'm pretty sure they're at the very bottom. And down there, it's completely sealed off. Yeah, we're just gonna take as much loot and we're gonna dip probably. But we're gonna try to fully raid these guys. Literally a revenge base raid. Even though some of this loot is actually ours. Yeah, my inventory is just full of loot right now. Full of uh, guns. I'm just going to put them in my vault. Yeah, my teammate is just blowing up everywhere with C4. I can't even get up here, I'm stuck. Yeah, I'm literally stuck. Maybe I can try to jump on the things? Yeah, we can. Well, my teammates had so much loot, I don't know. Oh yeah, I already see AMR ammo over there. That's actually incredible. Oh my god, oh my god, there's so much. Bro, we just got like 200 shots AMR. Yeah, these are going straight in vaults. Screw the guns. There we go, I just vaulted a bunch. I think there's people trying to counter as well. I don't know what the owners are doing. They're just hiding around at the, the very bottom. They're under us. We're trying grenades. He's right here. He's dead. Bro, there's so much loot down here, man. Some of it is gonna despawn. So we're just gonna have to pick the good ones instantly. I mean, it, mostly it's just PvP guns. There's a gas mask. Yeah, we hear them opening doors. They have to be down here. They have to be in this small triangular area. I'm pretty sure some of us are just depoting, looting, and going home. Because if we all just focus on trying to kill them. Alright, yeah, they're opening. He's right back here. We can't even get there. And they're opening still. They're just hiding in that area. Probably that's where the beds are as well. There's a bunch of mesh over here. A bunch of gump out there. MKP. And they're right above us. We're kind of pinned to be honest. Because I mean, he's right here. I mean, he's dead. He pushed with an auto shotgun man. That could have been deadly to be honest. Let me just destroy those items. So maybe we can see a bit better. Yeah my teammate could place a ladder. We could try to go up. Yeah, they're still throwing grenades. They're opening doors. I'm kinda scared that they throw a grenade and I don't even realize that it lands next to me. Yeah, they didn't hit anyone though. Just making sure they're not hiding in the loot. And yeah, they're still trying oh I may die actually. No, okay. I thought that was right next to me. Let's make sure we take the good loot. There's explosive compound, a bunch of mags. I'm still throwing grenades. They're not hitting anyone. Just a waste of grenades. I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna try to depot this loot. Yeah, we TP'd back. Oh, that grenade may kill me. And we're down here again. I don't really want to be down here, to be honest. He's right over here. He's dead. Quick and upload. I don't know. I don't know where... Another dude there dead as well. I can't do the jump, though. I'm stuck. There's a bunch of guns over here. Okay, my teammate go boom, boom, but we... Oh, dude, my teammate's dead. I hear them picking up stuff. Oh, he's right over there. Oh, he's dead. I don't know how I'm gonna get out of here, man. I need to TP out. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, my teammate got him. I don't know how they got up there, to be honest. I thought I cleared them all out, but apparently not. Alright, so I'm back. Oh, I'm dead. Alright, this is actually bad. I think we all died. It's okay, we can go back. Crazy thing is we didn't use raiding gear to actually get inside. We used raiding gear to get their loot. And we did profit a bit, but we're still gonna go back. There's a guy there. Hit him once. I should be so low, man. Yeah, I think they were just clearing up all of the loot. They probably rebuilt as well. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, they obviously rebuilt, but we're gonna use all of the charges. I don't know how much they actually put, but it's metal, so it shouldn't take that much. And we're gonna go straight in. Oh, that didn't even break. Alright, he's dead. Let's go loot him. Let's see what loot he had. And whatever he had, he seemed like yeah, he has a full outfit, full gear. Right, I'm gonna put the gun involved just in case if I die, I would always have it as a backup gun. Which is probably going to happen, to be honest. Yeah, my teammates blow up. I, I think they're through now. And yeah, they killed them with C4. Some loot glitched off. I don't know why they were at the top. They could have been at the bottom. The top, they were gonna die anyway. Right, there's a bunch of good items here. Yeah, nice. My teammates killed them. Huge. I saw a bunch of loot on the floor. Jesus. Yeah, let's take all of these adamantium walls as well. Need to figure out how we're gonna raid all of these lockers, man. I think first what we're gonna try to do is we're gonna try to get rid of their beds so that they couldn't come back. Oh god, that grenade might kill me. Oh no, we're okay. Yeah, you hear them opening down there. 
Oh, nice. All right, well, we went one more throw, but that's all triangular. It's all honeycomb. Yeah, so a lot of loot is still here. All right, my teammate just blew up a bunch of lockers. Literally, loot is falling everywhere. I don't even know what's new, man. I don't even know what those lockers have. Yeah, well, we cleared out another floor, though, at least. Right, so I don't think even the owners of the base are still here. I think they left. So we're just going to continue raid. There's still a lot to raid. A bunch of blockers at the Mantium as well. But yeah, we successfully online raided Revenge. Online raided people that offline raided us, which is kind of karma, to be honest. But yeah, they're geared as well. They're really, really geared. Now what we're doing is we're just raiding lockers, we're filling up our inventories, we're homing and we're depoting. Some of us have been doing that since the very, very start. They aren't even engaging in PvP. As soon as they raid lockers, they take the good loot and they depot it. Just very, very smart, to be honest. Alright, this locker broke, looks like a bunch of blasting caps. There's another AMR, bunch of meds, honey BA, or whatever it's called. Right, let's go back to the next one. I'm gonna use all of the AMR ammo that I got from this raid as well. Got myself a bunch of gun powder too. Another one broke. That one seemed full of loot, but it all just dropped at the bottom. I can't even know what loot there was. There's still a bunch of adamantium. All right, yeah, he's gonna put C4 for all of these crates. That's actually a really, really good idea. All right, that almost killed me, but that did a lot of damage. I almost died. I'm literally like 5 HP right now. Yeah, well, the adamantium, there's a lot of gunpowder, actually. It's just full of gunpowder all around. Okay, yeah, we definitely need this gunpowder. He gave me another AMR box. That's beautiful. And we're just gonna finish up all of these lockers with AMR because they cannot be raided with explosives. And that one broke. Looks like a lot of roll of lead. Yeah, that's basically it. I'll take that coin. And right, this one broke. Looks like a bunch of guns. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, let's refill our AMR. We still have all of these to raid. This one broke, looks like there was nothing in it though. And this one broke as well, looks like there was a bunch of clothes, some guns. Another one broke. Claim generator, lovely. Bunch of boards. This one broke, and uh, a but Okay, those are actually good, a bunch of key cards. That's incredible. I think we raided most of the base, actually. There's still a lot of loot all around uh, that we need to pick up. So that's probably what we're going to do next. We're just going to home a billion times, then come back, take all of the loot. But yeah, they have actually left the server. I do think that we have profited from this raid heavily. And we did some revenge. We did an insane revenge base raid. So yeah, that's it for this video, guys. After that, we did manage to take all of the loot. And that is where we also conclude the series. I really hope that you enjoyed. If you guys do want to see more aired content in the future, let me know in the comment section below. I really had a good time. A huge shout out to all the teammates that I was playing with. If it wasn't for them, then the series would have been completely different. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next one. Bye!